everybody so this is the demo part of the bobby brown and um um this is the skin long wear weightless foundation spf 15 control full coverage oil free shine control i'm going to be using this it does have a pump and i'm going to be using my real techniques brush it is dirty but um i washed it a couple days ago and i wore makeup yesterday so that is why so don't judge me okay so um i'm just a little messy there too i'm, I'm rushing you guys but i got somewhere to go <laughs> So I'm just putting a few squirts here. I don't know how many squirts I put, um, but I'm going to apply it to my face. And then um, I'm going to show you guys the wear test. So I'm putting this on in the morning. So it's going to be a nice long wear test. And, I, and this is the, my second time using this because I did use this yesterday. And so um, it does have a smell. Not too strong, but it may be sensitive to others, okay? So just keep that in mind, all right? So we're gonna speed this up. Right, y'all, so I had to come back a little bit. Um, um, to your um, this is not this is not gonna be full coverage. I'm just letting you guys know that right now, not not by just putting it on right now. I mean, you guys can see, but you really have to build this up. If you want the full, full, the the full, full, you're gonna have to you gonna have to build this up, like for real, for real. Um, to me, I don't care. Like I, I like full coverage, but then again, if it doesn't do full coverage, that's fine because I don't need that much makeup on my face anyway. Well, foundation on my face anyway. So I will come back and I mean I will put some more, but. I'm not going to OD. I'm trying to get my halos. I'm not going to OD because I really, you know, this is if you want to look like a natural look, okay, and don't want to look cakey, I guess. But you can definitely build it up if you want to. But you guys still see my dark circles, and I did put concealer on because I am going somewhere, so I'm sorry if that messes up the demo or the review, but we'll get into detail of that when we talk about the product. In full detail okay so I'm just gonna put a little bit more just focusing on like my under eyes a little bit just two squirts sorry about that I have uh, found I mean, uh, concealer on my own my hand too and that's it this is supposed to be like a net look like a natural finish so um, I like the way it goes on but you do have to hurry up because it does dry a little bit fast so you got to make sure that you are working in a a nice speed and i know i am because i got somewhere to go <laughs> i'm always rushing <laughs> so um yeah and the color i'm in is i'm sorry i forgot to tell you that is cool almond okay yep i got matched at sephora the match look good right tell me if it look good or not get in the neck area and stuff like that okay so again, this is like a natural everyday makeup. That's what it's looking like. Finish. And I have worn this yesterday, so I, this is not first impressions. And I can talk a lot about it right now because I have used it yesterday. Okay. All right. So I'm pretty much done blending. It blends easily. So you don't have to worry about that. dog bark i'm sorry y'all but yeah so you don't have to worry about that so yeah so that's just basically what it looks like and it doesn't go on it's not really red like when you put it on like look don't display my skin don't look, don't, bobby brown <sighs> y'all bobby brown like why what y'all doing to my life right now what are y'all doing like what are y'all doing to my life right now why are you looking like my skin like you look like my skin like don't it Y'all, 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 y'all. What's the rod? But yeah, so <laughs> sorry, so silly. But yeah, so this is it right here. So, all right. Um, what is it looking like? What? It don't really oxidize. This is this is it. Oh, this is okay. You know what, Bobby Brown? What, what, where have you been? You know where have I been? So like, nah, but it just came out so. I mean, this formula. Anyway, this is my first time using a Bobbi Brown product. 
you know, I'm moving up, moving up. <laughs> but yeah, so um, yeah, so this is what it's looking like. You know, let's do a little close up here. What's happening, y'all? It's very y'all. If y'all if y'all don't like looking like a caked up face, this is what you need. If y'all don't like if y'all don't like looking caked up, this is it. So I'm gonna be back, y'all, when I have everything on, hopefully. And then um, I'll show you what it looks like with all my face done. And then um, I'm gonna move on to the full detail review later on because I'm gonna do a wear test. Okay? So when I'm done with everything, I'll show y'all the time. Come back with the time. Hey y'all, so we are back with the wear test results. So we're gonna see, um, I'm gonna let you guys know what time it is. I'm gonna show you my phone, it's 11.14 right now. Yes, it is late. I tried to come back a little bit earlier, but I done took a nap and stuff like that. So don't mind my, my, little, my little locks, you know, they look like they're all over the place, but it's all good. But anyway, so I'm gonna get up close to show y'all the time. Um, Y'all can see my whole background set up and everything. All right, y'all, it's 11.15, as you guys can see. Okay, since we up close, um, the Bobbi Brown Foundation, I had it on since 10 this morning. So, as you guys can see already, off rip, the uh, <laughs> the smile lines, that's okay. It's, it's, y'all, if y'all follow me, y'all know the smile lines is always like that. Um, as far as the rest of the foundation, um, I think it held up pretty good and it looks very nice. We're going to get into it, but there we go right there. And then I don't got nothing to do with it. Um, yeah, so it just separated right there. That's all. And then you see the little bit of oiliness there. I'm going to touch myself up and just going to like put a little bit of powder right there. And, um, but that's it. It's not too bad. And I'm a very dry skin person. So, but we're going to get into that. So that's basically it y'all so it looks okay um so far so good so just the smile lines but that i'm not even worried about that and a little bit of a do doing this illumination type deal but that's okay so i'm just going to touch up and then i will be right back hey everybody welcome to all my new scrolls come on views and follows welcome and thank you for tuning in i'm all freshened up i uh, look a little bit better the smile lines are kind of going i hope i'm looking all right because i hope so if not you already know it's 11 it's 11 22 right now so nobody has time so i got everything together okay we cool okay so anyway now, so now we are at the review part of the video um finally because i know these can be a little long i apologize but you guys know i'm very detailed so please bear with me okay you guys want to know the scoop so this is what it is okay so i'm a little bit late to the party just a little bit because you know you gotta be quick you gotta be quick you know um in the beauty world but I'm not too, too late, so here we go. All right, so this is the Bobbi Brown Skin Longwear Weightless Foundation SPF 15 Full Cover Oil Free Shine Control, okay? So um, I will be showing you up close of, um, of how it looks and the consistency and things of that nature. And um, it does have a pump. Yes, everybody loves the pump. You know, nobody want to go out and buy an additional and stuff like that. You know, nobody want to be going like that. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes foundations do come like that. But overall, for the most part, most foundations do have a pump, which is great. Okay. So now we're just going to read a brief synopsis of this. And I'm going to read the back because it came in this box here. I did purchase this from Sephora, um, the, the store in the mall that I, um, in the mall. Um, I do have Cool Almond. It says 7.25. This is Bobbi Brown. This is one fluid ounces, 30 mLs. On the back, it says um, full long wear coverage that looks and feels like skin, not masky, heavy, or cakey. This high performance oil free formula creates a poreless, shine free finish with incredibly comfortable day to night wear. Silky emulsion to true to skin pigments, hydrate emollients, and wear extending. Um, ingredients floats over skin and delivers flexible breathable coverage instantly mattifies oily skin for a natural look that is never dry dull or flat it helps minimize oil throughout the day and reduces the appearance of pores over time stays fresh all day and into the night with coverage that lasts even in hot and humid climates um, usage is prime skin with moisturizer then apply foundation with brush sponge or fingers shake well before use okay so you have to shake this well um, um to be honest i don't think i shook this before i did it but you know 
okay you know i want to be honest in these videos but anyway <laughs> um okay so the claims are there i'm gonna look at my computer to see what else they have they have a variety of shades um I'm looking at Sephora.com. Um, the price is $46. I did pay $47, I guess, because of tax. Of course, I live in Jersey, you know. Um, but, um, you know, um, but the coverage, everybody wants to know the coverage. The coverage is medium. Okay, that's what it says on the website. Skin type, normal combination of oily. I'm dry skin. Very dry. Sarah does it. Okay, finish is matte um, and natural, it says. So, um, yeah, we're going to get into that. Um, SPF 15 um and what does it say what else it says okay you, you can read everything um it has on the website um the, the formula doesn't have any paraffin sulfates or um pethylates and um that's basically it and so they have the research results of what people said um you know 90 percent said it felt immediately minimized look of pores 92 percent said her skin felt her skin looked more even tone. 95% said immediately let their skin look shine free. 84% felt left their skin feeling hydrated. 91% said their skin looked fresh throughout the day. 81% said the foundation stood up to all the activities, okay? So you can find all this on the website, okay, you guys? I just want to give you guys a little brief synopsis and things of that nature. Um, so Bobbi Brown is a popular brand here. Um, you know, a lot of people talk about it on YouTube. And um, this is my first Bobbi Brown product, so I wanted to get my hands on this since this um they you know claim that it does have you know these type of great you know um claims on it and um you know a lot of people don't like to look cakey or looking like they're baking a cake in the oven we all don't want to look like that but sometimes you know people do so it's okay but anyway um but if you want to look like you're baking a cake it's fine all right so but i don't so you know that's basically about that so yeah, all right, so let's get into it. They tell you all other things, but I don't want to make that video. I just want to, you know, try to nip more in the bud. But you guys know how I am very detailed, so, you know, so that's basically it. All right, so we're just going to talk about the packaging. The packaging is bomb. I love, like, the frost-type porcelain glass-type deal, you know, like the little frost, you know. And I love the pump. The packaging is very nice and simple. It looks sleek, you know. It's not all over the place, you know. Got a black, you know, black, you know. It's no white top, the, um... You know, so, but it can get messy. So when it does, you know, just try to wipe it off, you know, with a makeup wipe or tissue or what have you. And um, so you won't get all that build up around there because you can get, you know, it can get messy, especially if you're rushing because most of the time I'm rushing. Nine times out of ten when I'm doing my makeup, like today I was rushing, okay? Um, But yeah, so that's basically about that. So yeah, so hence why the video just looks like that. Like, usually I talk after I'm done putting the makeup on. So this product, uh, when I was applying it to my face, I f it felt like, it felt natural, like a second skin layer to me. Um, It didn't feel like it was going to be cakey. My my face does feel breathable. That's one of the claims, I believe. Um, it doesn't feel cakey. It doesn't feel like it's hard. I don't feel a matte finish on my face. Like, it's not a matte. It feels like a natural. You know, I feel like I can talk comfortably. Like, I feel like... I can walk through the day comfortably. I'm sitting here and I don't feel like I have this makeup on my face. Like it feels very natural. It feels very comfortable and it really feels, it doesn't feel like we're baking the cake. Does it look cakey to y'all? Um, it doesn't look cakey to me. Um, and, um, the finish, um, it, it you it doesn't leave I'm, I'm a dry skin girl so it doesn't leave me like oily i mean it doesn't i'm sorry it doesn't like leave me looking oily like it, like you saw how i um how it looked um when i showed you guys what it looked like after you know before i put you know before i freshen up my face um it was a little bit but you know the highlight make make your face look a little dewy anyway but you know this area my t-zone area was a little bit oily just a little bit like like i said before you guys i'm a very dry person and i'm um, like probably right here and stuff like that but other than that it wasn't you know i, I still could have got away with it just the smile lines the smile lines were there but that happens with all of the foundation well most of my foundation it happens the smile lines happens um if i don't properly do what i'm supposed to do when i usually do my makeup so today i was a russian so that was consumer's fault my fault customer's fault that was my fault so um i'm not even going to um let that bring it down you know any more notches because um that doesn't have anything to do with it so um the claims that it says um it says full long wear coverage now as far as full coverage um I don't know how many pumps I use. You know, people say, oh, I use five pumps. I use 10 pumps. I don't even know how many pumps I use. I don't even know how many pumps I use initially. Um, probably about four or five pumps, you know, because people are um, anal about that. Um, but um, it, it's, it's, it's a medium coverage. It doesn't, it doesn't, it, you just have to build, okay, if you want to build. Um, but it, the point of it is to look natural. So 
as far as it not being full coverage, I don't need full coverage. So it's cool with me. Like I do have dark circles, but it's like as overall face around here, my forehead it, it's fine. Like I, I, I don't have a problem with that, you know? So, um, a medium coverage is fine me, especially if I'm going to wear it like every day, you know what I'm saying? Like if I'm going to work or, you know, just going somewhere real quick, whatever like that, or what have you, I will probably still wear it. Like if, if I want to wear it out all night, you know, I, I will still wear it too. Like it don't matter. Um, and it says it's oil free It's not masky or cakey. No, the claims is good right there. Um, and, um, it does feel hydrating. My skin does not feel dry cause I am a dry person. It feels very hydrating to me. Um, it says instantly, sorry, instantly mattifies oily skin for a natural look. I'm not oily, so I can't, um, you know, um, talk about that claim. Um, it says stays fresh all day. Um, it does stay fresh. You just have to, you know, um, blot a little bit. Like with me, I just had to blot a little bit, but if you're an oily skin person, I can't talk for oily skin. Um, you know, um, people, but for a dry skin person, this product is pretty good. I would say if you're looking for a product to look like a natural finish and not feel cakey or feel like it's too matte because it doesn't feel matte. Like my lipstick is matte. Okay. <laughs> Cause I feel it, but, um, the, this, the, it doesn't feel like matte or dry. It doesn't feel like I have to put lotion on my face. You know what I mean? Or baby oil or whatever the case, Vaseline. Um, so, but it's like a very comfortable foundation okay um let's see was it in my price range um okay we will talk about the price it is 46 i said it was 46 dollars okay that's cool whatever like that um i am moving up into the expensive type deal of products of makeup products but um you know if you if you are you know a youtuber and if you're an inspiring um mua or in um makeup enthusiast or whatever like that you want to try different things especially if, if some people come to you and ask you you can say oh i did try that stuff like that but anyway um, you know, but I just wanted to try it because I seen it around on YouTube and I was like, oh, let me just, let me just buy it. Let me just treat myself. Let me, I'll, I'll do it. It's cool. You know, whatever like that. So I did. So, um, at that moment it was in my, it was in my price range. Cause you guys know about that affordable type deal, but it was in my price range at that moment. Okay. Um, what else would I purchase the product again? Yeah, I, I would say, yeah, because this is my second time using it and i used it yesterday and i use it today i really do like it a lot and um i'm you know if i do wear makeup tomorrow i'm gonna i'm gonna use it tomorrow because I, it feels comfortable to me um how many stars i'll give it um five stars i don't have any negativity about it um you know um i'm sorry i don't have any negative comments about it um if it, it felt great and i'm glad i came on for a second um impression because i didn't have enough time to come on for a wear test you know yesterday because i did um, I was doing too much yesterday, so I didn't really have enough time to do a wear test, you know, and stuff like that. So I was able to do that today. Um, and, um, uh, would I recommend this for anybody? Yes, I would. If you really want to get a nice product, that's a natural finish. It doesn't feel cakey, something for every day, something that feels comfortable and natural looking, I would say, give it a try. I definitely will recommend it to those of you out there. Um, as far as the consistency from scale one to, I don't want to waste it, but yeah, I don't know. I want to scale one to 10. I would give it a, it, it doesn't move. It's like a creamy consistency. I'm going to show you guys the consistency. Um, I'm going to give it, and it's not really thick either. So I'm going to give it like a seven or a six, six point five, six point four, whatever the case is. Um, or a seven, like around there, because it's not really all that. It's not thick, thick to where you can't, you know, um, it's able to blend well, but you can feel when, um, it starts to get a little, you know, starts to get matte. So you have to work a little bit fast. That's the, that's the only thing with that. I'll still give it five stars because you know, I, I can, I can work with it. I'm using a brush, so I don't know how well it works with a sponge, but with a brush, um, it works well. But like I said before, you have to kind of work with it a little bit because as it dries, it does get a little matte. So, um, you have to hurry up and blend. Not saying you gotta be speedy Gonzalez, but you do. Um, but, <laughs> but anyway, um, but you just got to try and with me, um, I was speedy Gonzalez today cause I was in a rush. So it, it worked out for me so yeah so anyway just don't be all slow with it whatever like that whatever. if you want to work in sections you know whatever cool um but yeah just keep that in mind but that's basically and i want to keep running off at the mouth i know i could talk your head off but um yeah so i really do like this product this is a great product i know i know the price i know it's 46 dollars, y'all i know i'm not trying to push this on y'all i'm not trying to but i'm just telling y'all this is a great product for and it's good quality it's great like when i went to sephora i got i got color matched and the girl was like, yeah, you should, she was like, she was hyping it up. She's like, oh my goodness. She's like, oh yeah, your skin look nice. And it matched perfectly. Like she put it on. I was like, oh yes. And we tried another color. I forgot what it was. 
we did cool almond i think it was a color down or a color up i forgot which one and she said the cool almond looked better on my face so i was like okay yeah we're gonna go with that because i didn't even know it was on my face i was looking like did you put it right there because she did it right here and she put a full face on my face you know and she's like, oh, you want me to put a full face? I was like, oh, yeah. Like, not full face, but, you know, full foundation. And um, she only used a little bit. She was like, like, how many dots? Like, she used, she literally used, like, three and a half dots or three or four, or four dots. And I was like, oh, she she barely put on my face. And I was like, okay, this I'm, I'm sold. Okay, I'm sold. But you guys know I like the OD a little bit. But, you know, that's another story. But anyway, but I don't need the OD. But it, it's cool. You still can see, like, my, you know, natural features peeking through or whatever that, whatever the case. But I just, I just be concerned about my dark circles. But that's cool. That's what Clisilla is for so i'm good um but that's basically about that but yeah so i'm done i don't want to talk too fast or take up any more of your time but i hope you guys um see that this is a great foundation i would say pick it up you know treat yourself if you you know got an extra couple dollars and you're like you know what let me go get this if your birthday coming up tell people that give you a gift card to sephora or just tell them to buy this um you know whatever whatever else is coming up you know anniversaries or whatever the case is any special occasion then tell you know whomever that you care about or whatever like that please can you give me that bobby brown please like right there okay well give me the sephora's gift card i don't know but whatever you want to do you know whatever like that so get it that way you know so um but i know what i'm i everybody should know what i want for my birthday okay give me makeup or sephora gift card or you know something with makeup like that makes me happy <laughs> um but anyway that's one of the things that makes me happy but anyway um i digress but that's it you guys so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope i didn't forget anything if i did i'll definitely annotate it in the video um so i hope you guys are going to think about this and you know probably you know keep this in mind keep this on your wish list and um hopefully go out and get it because there are foundations that cost way more than this okay there's foundation that costs like a hundred dollars or more so this is not even that bad it's still in the 40s you know it's it's, it's okay you know I, I know i'm pushing it but you know i mean i, I when I purchased it, I was like, dang, but I was like, you know, I'm already at the, I'm already at the register. I'll take it. Okay. So I treated myself. So that's it. Um, so I really do like this foundation. I, I actually love it. Um, so I have been, you know, using it. It's my second day using it and, um, I really do like it a lot and I really enjoy it. Oh, the smell. It does smell like foundation. The smell, the smell isn't annoying, but you do smell something. So if you're sensitive, um, just make sure, just, just keep in mind that the, the smell can be just a, not too strong, but just a little bit. You do smell it. So just keep that in mind. Um, but that's basically about that. But I don't think there's anything else that I'm going to say about it. But I just like the packaging. That's that, that won me over. I opened it. I was like, oh, okay. Bye brown. you like, you got a sleek product here. Sleek packaging. Okay. You did that. Okay. I'm going to get out of here. Okay. Bye brown. You did that boat. You did that all right so that's basically it you guys i am out of here so go to sephora.com um or you can go to sephora um in your area and go purchase your bobby brown and um i'm trying to see what other stores are sold that um, i'm not really sure but i will definitely put it in the description bar below but i purchased mine from sephora so um that's basically about that so um yeah you better hurry up because um there are no well you know it's one um because, you know, you don't want it to get sold out because all these YouTubers are, you know, everybody's getting them. You know, the, the subscribers are like, oh, oh, you know, so, um, yeah, so, like, get it after you watch this video. If it's, if it's late, like, now, then don't get it, okay? <laughs> I know everything is closed, but the next day, you know, treat yourself. That's all. Treat, your, treat yourself. You know, it's all good. Okay, wait till payday. That's, that's fine, too. But that's it. Okay, let me get out of here, you guys. Um, But, yeah, so I'm out of here. So, if you have any questions, come to us with the ask. Ask comments below. Definitely answer your inbox. Or, yes, me, Marquee, 97, and Jeff Ron, Devin, Rod, Devin, Peace. Bye.